Hi drummers, this is our second drumstick review and it's about the Cran Slapper. Much fun. Okay, let's start with the review. First I took a look on crandrumsticks.com to see how they describe their stick. And this is what I found. Cran Drumsticks writes, a slapper is developed for drummers who like to feel the pull of a drumstick. Due to its taper design, the balance point is in the front, but the shape of the head gives a quick rebound. These ingredients result a fast, well-balanced drumstick. Optimal choice for downstroke drummers. This is what Cran Drumstick tells you about the stick. And now we're gonna test them and in the conclusion I will tell you if this is true or not. No matter which drumstick model you prefer, you can always choose between Hickory, Maple and Bubinga. There's only a difference in price, so the Hickory and the Maple cost you 850 whilst the Bubinga is a little bit more expensive with 1050. We compare all the dates to other drumsticks so that you can get an idea on how big or small or light the sticks are. As you can see, the Cran Slapper is a very long stick. I can give you another comparison. For example, the Benny Grab signature stick has 406 mm or the Vic Firth 2B has 430 mm, so even this stick is shorter than the Cran Slapper and the Cran Rock. About the diameter, the Cran Slapper has a diameter of 14.8 mm. In comparison to that, a Thomas Long signature model has a diameter of 16.5 mm or a Vic Firth 2B has 16 mm. So the diameter for my opinion is perfect for my hands but you have to test them yourselves. The weight. <coughs> As you've seen the Cran Slapper is a pretty long stick and also its diameter is bigger than the one of the Vic Firth. But because of its wood type which is maple you see how light it is. 42 grams against 49 of the Vic Firth here. Also another comparison, the Thomas Lang signature model has a weight of 62 grams, so you see the difference is enormous. The question is, how good is the durability because of that? But later about that. The Cran Slapper, as you can see, has a pretty small head compared to a Vic Firth 5A or Cran Rock. As you will hear in the following sound comparison video, the sound, like the name of the stick says, is slappy. I love the sound a lot because the mix between highs, lows and mids is amazing and the stick cuts through. I'm pretty excited about the result of the Cran Slapper concerning the durability because as I said the stick is a pretty light one compared to other sticks. I played through a 2 hour long playlist like I did with the other sticks to have a comparison. Here are some excerpts first of the 2 hour long playlist.
it's out of maple wood, the Grand Slapper did a fantastic job. Especially when compared to the Vic Firth 5A, you're gonna realize how good the durability is. I personally thought that the maple were gonna break or something like that, but nothing like that. The maple did a better job than the hickory wood. And yeah, let's see how the long term test ends, um, which is the more important one. But I will inform you when I have news for you. But the first look is just amazing. Conclusion about the Kranz Lepper Maple. Guys, I fell in love with this drumstick. In the last days, I played many different sticks, let's say 20 pairs from Vic Firth, Father, Promark, etc. And I always wanted to go back to the Kranz Slapper. It doesn't produce the normal maple airy sound. It sounds more like an hickory oak kind of drumstick. The rebound is just phenomenal and if you like rebound, these are the perfect sticks for you. Also the combination of light weight and great durability, which is not easy to achieve, impressed me a lot. I've never seen a stick that light with such a great durability. And the balance of course is also stunning and the price of 8 euros 50 is totally okay. The only thing that could be a little bit more in my opinion to make it the absolute perfect stick is a little bit more grip. Like I always say, this is just my personal opinion. You have to test them yourselves, build your own opinion about it. But I can recommend them absolutely because these are one of the best sticks I've ever played. I can assure you that. You won't be disappointed for sure.